Hello everyone, it's me AJ here and today I'm going to be building a circuit experiment and I'll take you through the step-by-step -step process of how to build it and then I'll tell you how it works once we're finished. So let's get started. Now, you have your grid here and what you're going to do is take, you're going to take four of these and then you're going to place them right here. So make sure to the corner with this amount of dots surrounding it. Then you're gonna take another one and place it five dots below. So count one, two, three, four, five, and then and then the dot after that fifth dot is where you place this one. And then um, you're gonna take another one and then place it six dots away. So count one, two, three, four, five, six, and then the one after that is where you put this one. And you put the same put another one the same distance away from this one so right there next step take one of these and place it one six dots away from these but one dot up so like so count one two three four five six and then go one up and then that's where you would place it it's almost in the center of both of them but that's the tricky part you have to make sure you place it in that exact exact spot next you're gonna take this, which holds three AA batteries, and actually take three AA batteries and put them in the battery uh, component holder thingy. I don't know. But anyway, you take three AA batteries and put them in this. Then you're then you're gonna take this piece and you're gonna take these little holes here. And then put them here make, make, and until they snap. Snap it. And then the reason that this block is here is so that this can rest on here. Otherwise, it's gonna get pressure from the other pieces pushing down and it's not gonna turn out so good and there won't be as good of a connection. All right, next step, you're gonna take one of these and actually you're gonna take one of these and then place it right here. Snap and snap. All right, now we can place this right, right here. Snap and snap. Make sure they snap. If you don't hear a snap, then they're not connected. Then, you're gonna take the color, the color. This piece is called color. And then make sure that the plus sign is facing the opposite direction of this. So it's gonna face this way. So see the little plus sign right here? We're gonna make sure it's facing that way. Now we're already almost done. Now, now all we have to do is take this piece and place it over this little light. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take this little fiber optics thingy and place it inside of there. Now, is the best part where we test out, test it out. Turn it on. Look at that, it's a light. Now the reason this works is because the battery powers a switch and then this little piece here uh, carries the energy from the switch. Because remember, when, when the switch is on, it allows the power to go through the switch to the other piece 
and into this piece. So basically it circulates from the battery to the switch, to the blue piece, and to the color piece, which makes this work. So I hope you enjoyed this experiment and uh, maybe if you have a kit like this, you can try it on your own at your own home. And uh, yeah, I'll see you next video.